Betelgeuse, the colossal red supergiant positioned in the upper left shoulder of the Orion constellation, holds a unique place in the tapestry of the night sky. Its vivid red color and volatile brightness, visible even to the naked eye, make it a standout among stars. Known scientifically as Alpha Orionis, it is technically the second brightest star in Orion but captivates astronomers and casual observers alike. This immense star's cycle of expansion and contraction, and its eventual destiny, fascinate scientists who are drawn to the possibility that Betelgeuse could someday explode in one of the most remarkable events we could witness, a supernova. Such an event would be nothing short of an astronomical spectacle and might offer humanity a rare glimpse into the incredible forces that govern the life and death of stars. Betelgeuse's name, rooted in Arabic and meaning the armpit of the giant, hints at its long-standing significance across cultures. Its iconic place within Orion the Hunter has inspired legends and myths for thousands of years. While Rigel, another giant star within the same constellation, outshines Betelgeuse in terms of brightness, Betelgeuse's deep red glow and enormous size make it even more distinctive. For ancient civilizations, this color marked Betelgeuse as a red star or ruddy star, unlike the more common blue or white stars surrounding it. Ancient Chinese astronomers, who meticulously recorded the appearance of stars, sometimes documented Betelgeuse as yellow, leading some scientists to believe that it might have been a yellow supergiant in the distant past. If this hypothesis is correct, it would mean Betelgeuse has shifted colors over millennia, an extraordinary journey revealing the evolution of stars on a scale almost beyond human comprehension. Betelgeuse's life is drawing to a close, but unlike smaller stars that burn for billions of years, Betelgeuse is part of a much more intense cycle. It's estimated to be only around 10 million years old, relatively young in stellar terms. However, massive stars like Betelgeuse consume their fuel incredibly fast. Our sun has billions of years left to shine, while Betelgeuse may only have a few hundred thousand at most, and some scientists speculate it could be even less. Currently, Betelgeuse is fusing helium into carbon and oxygen in its core, having long ago exhausted its hydrogen. Once it has no more helium, it will begin fusing heavier elements, leading up to iron. This process does not release energy, instead, it accelerates the star's collapse, eventually triggering a supernova, a spectacular cosmic explosion that will mark Betelgeuse's end and its transformation into something new. One of the most notable events in Betelgeuse's recent history was the so-called Great Dimming of 2019. Over the course of several months, Betelgeuse's brightness dropped to nearly one-third of its usual level, causing many to speculate that it was approaching its final stage. Observers worldwide turned their telescopes toward this massive star, eager to capture what might have been the prelude to a supernova. Instead, detailed studies using the Hubble Space Telescope and other advanced observatories revealed that Betelgeuse had undergone a massive ejection of gas and dust, temporarily obscuring its light. This cloud of material, hundreds of billions of times the mass of a typical solar coronal ejection, surrounded the star and blocked much of its light from reaching Earth. Such ejections are rare but provide insights into the mechanisms that drive mass loss in massive stars. This event gave scientists an unprecedented chance to study Betelgeuse's surface and atmosphere and understand how supergiants shed material before going supernova. Studying Betelgeuse has been an enduring challenge, as its characteristics make it difficult to measure. While it is about 650 light-years from Earth, its size varies considerably, as Betelgeuse is a pulsating variable star. This means that its outer layers expand and contract in a somewhat rhythmic cycle, causing fluctuations in both its size and brightness. Depending on the point in its cycle, Betelgeuse's diameter can change by nearly 35%, further complicating measurements. Astronomers have long relied on interferometry, combining light from multiple telescopes, to study Betelgeuse with precision. With these techniques, 
they have observed gas plumes extending far from the star, as well as dust clouds that contribute to its dimming, and apparent size changes. Betelgeuse's impending supernova could be one of the brightest natural events observable from Earth, potentially outshining even the full moon. When this explosion occurs, Betelgeuse will release an extraordinary amount of light, and radiation, visible even during daylight hours. Although the idea of a nearby supernova may seem alarming, the distance between Earth and Betelgeuse ensures that we would be safe from any dangerous radiation. Instead, this explosion would provide scientists with invaluable data on how stars evolve and die, as well as on the distribution of heavy elements like iron and carbon throughout the universe. These elements, forged in the heart of stars and spread by supernovae, are crucial building blocks for planets and, eventually, life itself. The study of Betelgeuse, especially with advances in modern telescopes and space observatories, has unlocked some of the star's deepest mysteries. Researchers now know that massive stars like Betelgeuse don't simply fade away. Rather, they end in an explosion that is not only spectacular but also a crucial process for cosmic evolution. The material ejected by Betelgeuse when it eventually explodes will enrich the interstellar medium with elements, which may become part of new stars, planets, and potentially new life forms in the distant future. By observing Betelgeuse and similar stars, astronomers gain insights into the life cycles of stars and the evolution of galaxies. Looking up at Betelgeuse in Orion's shoulder, we are reminded of the mysteries that await us in the cosmos. Betelgeuse's story, marked by ancient legends, scientific breakthroughs, and the potential for a grand finale, is a vivid illustration of the life and death of stars. One day, perhaps in our lifetime, Betelgeuse may go supernova, lighting up the night sky and offering humanity an unparalleled view of the cosmic cycle. Until then, we continue to study this massive star, gathering clues and deepening our understanding of the universe. If you're as captivated by Betelgeuse and the wonders of the cosmos as we are, let us know in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe to Waves Discovery for more in-depth explorations into the mysteries of space.